everyone, welcome back to another video. Today we are at Epcot. We are here for just one day to do Festival of the Arts. So I'm also here with Michaela. Hi. <laughs> if you guys remember her from my July trip, if you haven't seen those videos, I will link those above. But yeah, we're just here for one day because I needed my fix. So I think we're gonna start with some pictures and then we're gonna go do paint a number, which I'm not even sure where that is. So I do have to figure that out, but I do just have to say that the weather is chef's kiss. And I also got the strawberry iced mocha something from Joffrey's. It's just a strawberry iced coffee with almond milk and so far so good. It's very strawberry-y and this was like 6.50. So yeah. It's gonna be a great day, so let's go ahead into the park. Okay, so when you walk around the back side of the ball, and then like you're going towards World Showcase, right here's where you can do the paint by number, but it's 9.53 and they're not open yet, so, but then right up here is where you do it and it is free. So I wasn't sure if that cost money, so just so you know, that is free. They do it daily until five, and I guess they start at 10. So we'll come back for that. So since we walked over here, we're just gonna do Figgy because he's a walk-on. It's a good way to start. Farts anyway. And Michaela's never done Figgy. So excited. I think you're gonna find it annoying, but <laughs> it's cute. It's cute. Double Front row. row. All together, if you would please read line three. Quick review of Figgy. I think. like Figgy. He's very old, dude. He's I, feel very like, old. I feel like he's from like the like, 70s. I feel like probably six out of ten just because he's pretty old. Yeah. But the song is like so catchy but for me. Cute. Yeah. Great way to start Festival of the Arts. Now we're actually gonna go get the rainbow cake because I didn't know where it was, but now I do. <laughs> so yes. Heading over to the Odyssey to get our rainbow cake and our grape smoothie. So now we're over at Figment's Inspiration Station. We're gonna try both of these things. So it's a grape smoothie with freeze-dried Skittles. Oh, that's a cute cup. Right, but it's plastic. I saw like, it's like a squishy one, but oh, that's okay. But it's cute. Yeah, and then the rainbow cake with the freeze-dried Skittles. So nice little sweet breakfast. I don't even know, why does it like, <gasps> Odyssey Pavilion is currently closed. Nar. Oh, I thought we you just had to like enter on the other side. Guys, what the heck? We need to go get you food somewhere, so what should we do? Because there's definitely no one in there. Why is nothing open yet? It's 10.16. The park's been open for over an hour. It's probably just because it's like breakfast time. I feel like it's probably starts opening up at lunch. All right, well, I know Connections has that drink and- Yeah, we should go back that way. They I have forget something. what else is on the list for there. I don't know, let's look at our list and maybe just see what's open. Okay, maybe so nothing. Too. Our best bet probably is connections because we can get um, like they just have like your basic breakfast there So if we can't find anything then you know, but it's very beautiful today right now. It's 74 I'm melting, but it's fine. We just got the figment waffle and he looks really sad Not sure what I'm gonna do about that But hey, I'm still gonna get my picture and everything's gonna be fine And then this is the dusk till dawn drink So you just like put that cotton candy in there and it's gonna dissolve this is has three olives, blueberry vodka, lemonade, orange juice, and cotton candy, and it was $14.50. So let's see what this looks like when we put the cotton candy in there. Ooh. Oh shit, that looks cool. So figgy waffle's gonna be a no for me. I don't like like that much Jimmy, Jimmy John on the end. I give the figment waffle 
You never try it. No, I give it a four out of ten because for the, appearance, the presentation is just not great. Uh, but I've seen like other pictures and it looks good. This drink. Yeah, that drink is good. It's very good. I don't taste any alcohol. It's 10:48 in the morning. If anyone's wondering. <laughs> I've never had the three olives. Very vodka. Very vodka, yeah. I thought it was gonna That's be like probably why it doesn't taste like alcohol. Obviously. Yeah, because it's already like so sweet with the cotton yeah. candy and the lemonade. Very good though. So the drink was good, but I don't feel anything. And for $15, I would like to feel at least something. So I would say the drink's good, but I probably wouldn't get it again for $15. And the waffle, absolutely not. Just way too sweet, way too not for me. I'm not really a breakfast girly. So it's now 11 we just filmed a little bit of a reel slash tiktok we're gonna see if we can pull that off but we're gonna see if it looks like it is we're gonna see if we can do a paint by number now so we can just get that done and over with and then maybe make our way into world showcase because we have frozen at 11 25 okay and it's 11 04 so should be perfect timing so let's go do paint by number so we didn't get to pick our numbers but we got seven and twelve so yellow and red So I didn't vlog the paint by number because it was kind of hard and I was also doing a picture and a reel, but this is what the final one is going to look like. So that's cute. And Pooh is out over here, so we are going to go change into our Pooh shirts because we got matching shirts. And then we're going to go get our picture with him and then it will be time to ride Frozen. So we just got our picture with Pooh in our matching shirts to say we'll be friends forever. And I just got the same one on and he was very excited to see us. but. My camera went blurry, so I don't know if I even got that. But now it is finally time for Frozen. So we're gonna do that, and then I'm gonna do one more outfit change and stay in that shirt for the rest of the day. And then we'll get a locker to put this bag in, and then just keep riding some rides. So this morning was all about content, the afternoon is all about actually having fun riding rides. So we just got off of Frozen, and that was actually the least wet I've ever gotten on that ride, but I didn't wanna film it because I was afraid it, my camera was gonna get wet and I didn't wanna ruin it. Now we're going over to Inspiration Station to finally try the rainbow cake and the grape smoothie, and then one more outfit change, and then the lockers. As you can see, the day just constantly changes, but it's kind of how it works when you're working around Genie Plus. So we finally got our rainbow cake and the grape smoothie. This is so freaking cute. I'm not really a big grape person, but we'll see if I like this. You already tried it? Yeah. What'd you think? I think I would like it better if it was like more slushy and not so like creamy smoothie like. But yeah. She's, yeah, she's all right. I really just got it for the cup. I should have just asked them to like just give me the cup. Like I just, I would have paid the same price, but just for the cup. But it's very cute in here. I don't think I've ever actually sat in here. And then you can also mobile order the Figment popcorn buckets, which are right behind us. I do want one, but it's just not really realistic for me to bring that home today. So, not a big deal. But let's try this cake. I'm sure it's gonna be like very, very sweet. And that's like all we've had today so far is sweets. Yeah. So after this, like yeah, after this we have Frozen and then Guardians. So then after that we're switching over to the salty stuff. Yeah, you know what? Just give me your impression while you're already good. No, go ahead. I'm just, I'm, since I'm rolling, might as well. Oh. I'm not expecting it to taste that way. Okay, now I need to try. Oh my gosh, wait, yeah, it does taste like Fruit Loops. I didn't even get a picture of this yet. <laughs> I'll get a picture from like the top. It's really good. Like the, the lemon, it's, it's definitely like a lemon icing inside. Yeah. Really good. All right, time to try this smoothie too. I just love all the colors. Like this is so fun. <laughs> She's pretty. Tastes very much like Skittles. It's very like cough syrupy. Oh my god, this is a look. My hair and the sunglasses and these ears. Um, it's a little too syrupy for me. I don't think it's syrupy. I just think it's like. It's yeah. It's very milky. Oh, you know why there's coconut milk in this? And I don't like coconut milk. Mm, yeah, I'm not a coconut gal. Things you do for a cup. <laughs> but you know what, it's really not that, like, there's not that much. I can probably get this down, or I'll dump some of it out and like rinse it out in the bathroom and then put it in my bag. But the cake is very good. I would highly recommend getting the cake. How much was everything? 15.75. 
And we got two slushies and the cake for that one. So, yeah. So we finally dropped off our stuff at the locker, switched over to the fanny, and it's now 12.50. This day's like really flying by, but we have Soren. What time was Soren supposed to be? 12.20. Okay. So Soren and then straight over to Cosmic Rewind. And then probably back to eating. So yeah. So we'll see you guys over at Soren. Soren was great as always. We were row one, so that was actually kind of new. I'm used to having people's feet in my face, so that was nice. Now it's 1.20, so it's time for our Guardians Lightning Lane. I almost wanted to say Fast Pass. What song do you think we're gonna get? Mm. I'm hoping for September. I'm gonna speak into existence that we're gonna get September. All right, cool. I won't be mad with Everybody Wants to Rule the World, though. I won't be mad at that either. I will probably be mad. I will be mad at Conga <laughs> or Iran, so. Either way, I still just love the ride, just love being on it, but let's see what song we get. Virtual, come on up. These are virtual. Thank you, Nikki, right? The wonders of Xandar. I forgot to show you guys my rainbow glasses. You like? My other one's broke twice today. The eye thing popped out and then the side piece broke off, so. Bought these because they're matching the rainbow fit. Very cute. Hey, I'm going to your vehicle. We'll be right behind you. Nothing to worry about. Unless we cannot stop this unusually large man. Then you're likely doomed. Drax! You're gonna need it. I think we're jumping back. got it we got September it was so fun and I actually know the song but like I pretended like I didn't know it on the ride so <laughs> you heard me sing it and it was the wrong words <laughs> it is what it is um, okay so now I've gotten everybody wants to rule the world one way or another and September which were my top three anyway so I'm very very happy and now it's time Ooh, do you want to try to go into space 220 for more or not yeah I don't think so what do you think we have a lot of food to try around the world. Yeah, we we haven't even started that. Okay, so let's head over to World Showcase and get started with our food adventure today. Stopping by to look at the artwork real quick. I forget what this is called. It says it like right outside, but. Ooh, I like that one. That one's cute. That's super cute. I know Brad would love this. Sorry, babe, I'm not rich, but it's cute. <laughs> And Mare, stunning. One, I love. <gasps> Ooh, that one too. Oh. I think that there's a very special place in heaven for artists because like they are just superhumans. Oh my gosh, the figurines. So cute. Oh, these tables, they're like, Oh my god. I forget how much these are, but these That's are like cute. expansive. I really like the Little sure Mermaid one. So cute. So we stopped in Mexico at Choza de Margarita. <laughs> I'm not gonna pretend like I can say that. <laughs> and then I didn't get anything, but they got something that looks good. What is it called? Tostado de Pollo. Oh. <gasps> it's delicious. ¿Y te gusta? Mm -hmm. ¿Está bien? ¿Y qué es eso? <laughs> What's that? The strawberry margarita. Oh, strawberry marks. Okay, so our first stop's gonna be at the Painted Panda at China. And me and Mick are gonna split the General Tso's chicken shumai. And unfortunately, I'm so thirsty that I'm gonna buy Dasani. I know, tragic, but you gotta do what you gotta do. So let's see how this is. All right, so here's the General Tso's. Looks pretty good. Yeah, let's, let's see how she is. I don't know. I guess we should have grabbed knives too. So here's a look at the inside. It's like soft chicken. I don't think this tastes like general toast. No. Um, she's like 
I like like the wonton like wrapping. Yeah. And it's got the flavor, but the texture's like throwing me off. Of the chicken. Mm -hmm. so it's like a meatball. Yeah. It's not bad. But I honestly it again. It tastes like a hot dog. <laughs> this is not general juice. It's not bad though. Like I can finish this for sure. But not worth 1075 and wouldn't get it again. I'd say like a five out of ten, actually. Six and a half. The flavor's pretty good. What's your rating? Um, I feel like a five out of ten. Yeah. Okay, you know what? Now that I've finished it, I'm gonna change my rating to like an eight out of ten, and I would get it again. The I'm flavor. <laughs> the flavor was just so good. And I'm actually kind of full from that, not gonna lie. And this is our first stop along our eating path, whatever you want to call this. Personally, I think it was too hot doggy. It was not chicken. It was probably some sort of beef. Yeah. Um, it did say it was chicken. It tasted like a meatball. Like, but yeah, like also a meatball. hot dog. Yeah. I don't know. I still think 5 out of 10. <laughs> Alright. So let's see what we try next. Also chugged this whole Dasani, so it actually really didn't taste that like minerally. So or chlorine, I guess. Because I freaking hate this on me, but this was not that bad. Probably gonna buy another one because it's freaking hot today. So let's move along. I like just can't get over how gorgeous of a day it is. Like I'm sweating, but you know, I would take the sweat over the cold. Anyway, we're over at Italy now. We're gonna try the mozzarella fritta. This is what it looks like. Nine dollars for a literal breaded piece of cheese, but you know what? It's cute. It's picture worthy, so we're gonna do it. So I also got the Bellini, which I'm not really sure what's in it, but it sounds pretty like sweet. And then this is the mozzarella, tomato, pesto, balsamic base, and mayo chai. Found a nice quiet section behind the little Italy booth. I forget what it's called, like La Notte Menagerie. Something, Something like, like that. that. <laughs> Um, but the Bellini's pretty good. It's not that big for $14, honestly. It's good, but I probably wouldn't get it again. I'll let you know, depending on how I'm feeling after I eat it and drink it. Okay, maybe maybe it is good. No, I'm just kidding. Okay, let's try the mozzarella. This was $9, and this is how big it is, so. Oh, she is cheesy. Mmm, the pesto's really good. What is the brown sauce? A it's like a balsamic glaze. Balsamic glaze, yeah. Mmm, mmm. I really like that one. Okay, and then up next is the mayo chop. I already eat my fries in mayo chop, so. It's good. It's probably gonna be just how I'm expecting. Mm hmm. I just love mayo chop. It's the best condiment besides Chick fil A sauce. Don't at me. All right, and then the pesto. Mm. I just love pesto. Yeah. Ooh, that's so good. And then this is just a tomato sauce, so I'm sure that's just like your typical mozzarella dip. Yeah. Um, honestly, I really like the balsamic glaze. They're all good. None of them disappoint, so this is good. It's just a matter of do you want to spend like eight, nine dollars on just this tiny little piece of mozzarella. But that's like everything at the festival, honestly, so. Another win for me. Balsamic glaze is definitely my favorite. Yeah, very happy so far with our little tour around the world. Okay, mozzarella, 10 out of 10. I agree. And that Prosecco, was it was per no, not Prosecco. Mm -hmm. Bellini, it was good. Feel a little mm -hmm. something, something. But nothing like crazy. I We're gonna keep the buzz going. We're at the America. Bellini, like, um, like a seven out of ten. I just like it's a little bit too much spritzy spritz for me. <laughs> yeah, I know what you mean. You know, okay. The mozzarella is delicious. What are you getting from uh, Regal Eagle? Moonshine sour. Obviously. Moonshine sour. That's it. Oh, they have the frozen mint jalap. I think I tried that last time. What'd you get? Frozen mint jalap. I don't know, maybe I'll get the Moonshine Sour too. I don't know, let's see. Michaela got the Moonshine Sour, the best selling drink in Epcot if you're wondering. And so I had FOMO, so I got it too. 
treat yourself. Okay, ready? Right? Treat yourself. This is really good, but it's very sour. So not good for girlies with GERD and acid reflux like me. But we do it anyway. Yeah, but it's not that sour. It's just a little bit sour. It's sour JK when you have an issue. Sour. Great. Yeah? Yeah. All right. Cheers. Cheers. This is my first time walking back to Morocco. And it's so cute back here. It's so like festive. So freaking cute. Ooh. Yeah. Like, where do you want doll hair? Not the doll hairs. I link. I link. <laughs> I like the one I tink. Super cute. So in between Morocco and France is the Encanto booth, which I had no idea where it was. But I'm most excited to try this today. So let's get it. And then frozen pina colada. Mm -hmm. It sounds pretty good, but I don't know. I don't know if I want something like frozen. I don't know. What, what do you want? We gonna split some? I think I want a frozen pina colada. We're on drink number four. Michaela's drunk. <laughs> I'm. It was that margarita. Oh, the first one. Yeah, yeah. you said that was strong. I'm like okay. Mmm. This is good. Mm, a little too coconutty for my liking. Look at all the trash in front. I didn't even realize. <laughs> That's a good shot. <laughs> so I finally got the chorizo and potato empanada. I don't really know, but this looks really good. So me and Nick are gonna split this. Um, also, I am now gonna start counting how many people comment on Taylor's shirt. <laughs> yeah. Because we're so, so far at two. <laughs> My shirt just says Choose Kindness. It's from Pink a couple years ago. One person complimented it as like an actual compliment, and then somebody else like, where is he? Somebody else complimented it, but like jokingly. I don't know if I'm gonna get much of the goo in here, but that's what the inside looks like. It was so hot. This is hot and it's hot out here. Mm. Is she yeah. good? Yeah, she's good. What is on top of her? Like mustard? Mm. Kind of like sriracha. Mm. Ah! Do you taste a lot of potato? Not yet. For the record, I do not like potatoes or mashed potatoes. What? I only like french fries. Bro, <laughs> since when? Bro, since always. That is so <laughs> fake. I've known you for like 15 years. I would have known if you don't like that. You have not known me for 15 years. That's Bro, a lie. I've known you since my older me. Yeah, no, literally like 10 mm. years. No, she's good. I like her. Yeah. That's good. Okay. All we have left is France, so are we gonna get our brioche things today? No? I don't know if I'm gonna be able to stomach that after this, Should to be honest. Should split one? I'd be down. Yeah. Yeah. We'll see if they actually have it, because the last couple times I went there, they didn't. Oh, really? Mm-hmm. But they always have it. No, they were sold out. But I was also there at night. Anyway, that's it for the Encanto booth. I think that might be it for our world tour. I'll let you know. The empanada? Very good. Very spicy. I'd say... <laughs> I'd say like a 9 out of 10. Pina colada is a little too coconutty for my liking. But she's keeping the dogs going, so it's fine. I do think that my favorite thing so far has been the general soda, to be honest. But we are still going to try the grilled cheese from Poppy. And I think that's going to be it for our world tour. Because we're getting cold, we're getting wet. It's time to go right to butter. But let's go try the... All right, y'all. Finishing up the world tour at Pop Eats. I'm freaking beat. We're gonna get the regular tomato soup with grilled cheese, five seventy-five. Oh, I'm so full <laughs> and tired. Love a good grilled cheese sandwich. Yeah, this is real good. Mm-hmm. Got some Texas toast right there. That's good. What a great angle. All right, guys, Matayla, 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 <laughs> Michaela has to tell you something about test Michaela track. Nicole. <laughs> okay, guys, hear me out. Test track is stupid because when you, well, no, the ride in itself is not stupid, but when you go to, like, make the car, that's stupid because, first of all, you get in the car with strangers and you don't know what settings they put their car on and it's not the color you make it and it's... <laughs> Not that they could do that, but 
like it's not your it's not really your settings because you're in it with strangers who have totally different settings but it doesn't the, even make sense the point is for your car to race their car yeah but like you're in the same car <laughs> how does that make any okay sense? that's fair it's very fair anyway we're gonna wait for it because there's no more lightning lanes available it's 70 minutes but you know we ate around the world we're feeling good we want to ride a ride feeling good. <laughs> feeling good just bloated um but yeah let's wait 70 minutes i'll let you know how long we actually wait though all right so i was just telling michaela that maybe we should like just cancel our flight and stay another day <laughs> and maybe just go like swing <laughs> by all stars <laughs> yes bro because she keeps asking me if our flight got delayed so i'm just like and then we'll just swing by target get some shampoo and conditioner and some body wash because oh we need some body wash <laughs> And then, like, tomorrow we can go to, like, Animal Kingdom and Magic Kingdom. Oh, yeah, let's do it! <laughs> Alright, LFG. I get to design the card today, ma. Oh, this one looks nifty, but are we gonna get good aerodynamics? No, no, probably not. Probably not. not. Gotta trace it. What? What are you doing, bro? No! <laughs> yeah, they're optimizing the design. Yeah, that looks good. Yup. Michaela was not happy with my car. She's up in our numbers. Is that good? I don't know. Well, you got a minute. I don't know how to do this. How do you fix it? I don't know. Oh, yeah. Um, I don't know if that's how it works. I don't know, it's fine. We can't go back any further. It's she is a very cute color. Here. She's big. I don't know if touching that's gonna work, honey. Do we have to scan again? No, 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 no. So I guess we're just done. Kitty! Welcome to the sea track. Spaceship Earth, and we, we got the ugliest picture of ourselves ever. <laughs> we gave ourselves as many chins as we possibly could, and then we got random people's pictures. So 
I'm nervous that someone got our pictures. And when I tell you, these faces were the worst faces I've ever seen in my life. We need to go. Because I don't know where these people are that might have gotten our picture. But anyway, we're going to go shopping now. And then try to get on Guardians one last time, which is at 6.40. We need to be out of here by like 8 at the latest to catch our flight. Yeah, Because they actually bump bumped our time back. They our did. flight got delayed. And got delayed by like 15 minutes. Now it's back on track. If we miss our flight, then we'll just stay the night. <laughs> and we'll come here tomorrow. <laughs> Okay, wait. These beaded ears in person are actually pretty cute. 35? Why are your ears so expensive now? Mm, I'm probably not gonna buy them. But, like, maybe without the bow, I think these be, would be super cute. That is cute. It's a little hidden Mickey, and it's rose gold. You know I dig that. Rose gold is my thing. I like this pillow, too. Do you have those? I have sequin ones, that's what I have. Oh, I'm not a fan of those rhinestones, TDH. Like like oh, I like that pink blanket I was looking at that last time. Yeah. What is this? This is cute. Is this a stony hat? I don't think it says, but it definitely looks like a stony collab. That's cute. <laughs> Haven't seen this hat or this bucket hat either. This one's cute. Change plans again. <laughs> we were on our way over to the locker. We were almost there. And then our boarding group got called. But it's just a hassle to bring our backpacks on the ride. So we're going to do this really quick. It's what, 6.05? Uh, it's 6.10 now. 6.10. So we're going to do the standby. And then we're going to shop on our way back to the locker. And then from the locker, walk over to Beach Club and get our Uber and leave. So that's, that is the final plan. It's what we're doing. And hopefully everything goes smoothly. And now I genuinely don't care what song we get. I almost like want to get Iran or Conga just because I haven't. Maybe Conga. Oh, let's go this way, Nick. Yeah, I think Conga's like a little bit less annoying than Iran. So let's see. Let's see if we can check two off of our bucket list today. What is Iran? I never and Iran. I run so far away. You don't know that one? No. All right. Let's see. I'm actually not gonna film this one, but I'll just let you know. Or will I? I don't know. We'll see. <laughs> okay, we got exactly what I predicted. Once again, <laughs> we got Conga. So that's. Oh, we're going to Creations. Um, so that's five out of six, and it was really fun. I knew it as soon as it started, which was really fun because it was just a jam party. That was a fun song to dance to. Thought it was really fun. Conga was fun. And I thought it was fun because we sat in a totally different seat, so it was like a different perspective of the ride. Yeah, we sat like more towards the middle, so. Alright, that was unfortunately the last ride, but we ended on a good note, so let's go do some more shopping and then head over to Beach Club so that way we can get our Uber from there because I think it'll be a little bit cheaper. So this is all I'm gonna get. We don't really have too, too much in here, honestly. We were in here earlier and nothing was really like tickling our fancy too too much. Mick's just gonna get a mug for her boyfriend. Yeah. Now time to head back to our locker and call it a night. We're back at the airport. We did it. It was a <laughs> great day. Um, we just wanna quickly go over our highlights. So for me, it was writing Guardians and getting two new songs and two new songs that I wanted and like the ones that I called were the ones that we got. So that was really fun. And just like dancing, sitting next to Bestie Girl, having a fun time. It was good. It was a long day. I'm getting ready to go take off all my makeup and get changed. <laughs> I think I'm gonna try to sleep. A little bit yeah, I definitely did too. Well, I don't really see it now, but we'll see it tomorrow. But what was your favorite part? Um, definitely going on Guardians, because I love that ride, I think it's so <laughs> fun. Oh, sorry, I'm gonna censor that out, you can just do a little bleat. Yeah. And then I really had fun drinking around the world today, Yeah. we had fun. We definitely got lit. Yeah, we did. Alright, so that is all for this week's video, thank you so much for watching, make sure that you give this video a thumbs up and subscribe for new videos every Friday, and I will see you real soon, bye.